So yeah, no, sabi nga dito, the endowment plan provides you with protection and earning components. So itong plan na to, basically, if you were to consider it as a burger, marami siyang potential components that you can add on to it, parang topping. So yung itlog, let's say, no, yan yung dividends, and then the endowment is the bacon. So basically what this means is that the burger itself can live on its own and these toppings, dividend endowment, can be freely taken out of the plan and the plan will still continue to be active. And so with respect to the protection component, basically in this plan, whenever you put in premiums, these go 100% towards your guaranteed benefits. So let's say you avail the for 1 million plan, whatever the premium is stated there, yan na po yung ginagamit in order to fund the whole plan. So, ang meaning nito is the contribution period is guaranteed, no? So, this is another feature that is unique to an endowment plan compared to a VUL. So, pag sinabi namin 10-year plan po itong endowment plan, it means after 10 years, siguradong done na yung plan. Meaning, the plan will continue to earn dividends in endowment if there are any, and you will no longer need to contribute to this plan, no matter what happens, even if the market moves down. Now, because this is a guaranteed contribution period and basically you're carrying no, the 100% of the guaranteed protection benefits, you will also expect that the premium load is slightly higher than the VUL plan. No? I said the basic premise here is that with the VUL plan, you're investing in a fund and you're hoping this fund is enough to sustain the plan. Dito naman, you're putting into this plan at a certain specified guaranteed period, and then the plan will really exist or be sustained until age 100. So usually, you get the basic life coverage, so that's your life insurance, and then you can also enjoy optional add-ons or riders, just like in a VUL plan. So you can enjoy waiver of premiums in case of total disability to ensure that the plan continues even if the person is no longer able to work. There are accidental death benefit for additional protection for the family. And then there's critical illness and hospital income benefit for the health protection aspect of the plan. So this is very similar to a VUL plan. Now, a unique rider or a unique add-on of an endowment plan is the living benefit rider. It's a free rider that's included in most of our traditional plans. Basically, it gives you the option to advance 60% of your face amount in case of terminal illness. So, knock on wood, in case 12 months to live, the person has the ability to convert to cash a portion of the life insurance. Kung baga ma-advance na, to use it for any expenses that might be incurred as a result of the terminal illness. Now, you also get bonus earnings. So, yun na yung toppings na na-mention namin kanina. So, yun na yung dividends, endowments, and special data bonus. So, itong uh, uh, itong bonus earnings ito, dahil bonus lang siya, parang additional topping, so to speak, they can be withdrawn regularly and the plan will still continue. Now, there's also a second option to allow you even further fund growth and that is to leave these bonus earnings in the plan and they will earn interest. No? So, parang sa banko, merong interest per year. And our usual interest rate is ranging from 3 to 3.8% per year. So if you compare with a basic or a standard savings account, mas malaki yung potential in terms of interest earnings. Okay, so one thing that I would like to highlight about an endowment plan or a traditional plan for that matter is that the policy or the protection component is separate from the earnings component. So as mentioned earlier, you can withdraw all the earnings component and the benefits will still be intact. No? So they're not uh, living under one roof wherein the earnings are the ones uh, sustaining the plan. No? So separate siya, bonus lang talaga siya. So what are dividends? So dividends are bonus earnings received based on Sun Life as a company, how it has performed. No? So basically, you get a share of our earnings no? uh, as a company. So sabi nga dito, it's not guaranteed but always positive. So it just simply means that every year you will get a certain amount of dividends. How much exactly will depend on the performance of Sun Life as a company. Yung kagandahan ng dito is if it's always positive. So even if the market goes down, Sun Life as a company will still give dividends. And let's say on this year you get dividends of 10,000. Next year, hindi yan bababa. No? So it's always positive. And it will in fact grow further because of the interest rates. 
So sabi nga dito, the interest is also non-guaranteed but always positive. So it's very similar to a bank. No, the bank accounts never tell you what percent interest you're going to be expecting every year. Siguro na namang ni interest, pero hindi lang nila sinasabi if ibababago nila or iaakit. And then the endowment, yan na yung guaranteed earnings that we were talking about a while ago. So on top of the dividends, you get this additional benefit as well. And this gives you a guaranteed earning based on the face amount available. So yan yung beauty dyan. It doesn't... Um, it doesn't matter, kunyari, uh, the market is up or down. It doesn't matter how often you put in, no? Ang important dito is, kung ano yung face amount na kinuha mong plan, the endowment is locked in based on that. And as long as tinapos natin yung plan, whether it's a 10-year plan or a 5-year plan, you will get this tuloy-tuloy na. So usually, this is something you earn on your 6th or 8th year. So imagine you have plans wherein you have to put in 10 years, pero sa 6 year pa lang, may nakukuha na ulit tayo. And these, when left in the account, also earns interest. So always remember the interest is non-guaranteed but always positive. And then finally, we have the cash value. So every or most traditional plans have a cash value. And basically, this is the amount you will get if you decide to convert your policy to cash upon termination. So when we say convert to cash, parang Done na tayo sa plan, we don't want the benefit anymore, the protection benefit. We want to get the corresponding cash value of these benefits. No? So this is usually ideal when you have an emergency need or when you need a larger bulk of money. So this is available to you. So um, ang cash value, another purpose of that is it determines how much loan you can get against the policy. Meaning, let's say your cash value is 100000 you have a premium of 1,000, meaning nun, if na-miss out natin yun, we can still loan that 1,000 missing premium against the cash value because there is enough cash value to handle it. So that also provides a certain safety net just in case times are rough and mahirap tayo mag-contribute, at least meron tayong ganong component. So these cash values are indicated in the proposal. They're guaranteed amounts and they change per year. Okay, so in order for us to better imagine how it works, I created a sample endowment plan. It's called Sun Smarter Elite Peso 10. And I computed it for a 30-year-old non-smoker male. So if you were to invest you know, around 100000 per year, this is what you can possibly get. So in terms of protection, so remember there are two components, the protection and the earning component. So in terms of protection, this person would be able to enjoy 1 million life coverage till age 100. So at least, no, um, way beyond life expectancy. Meron ng safety net for the family. On top of that, in case of death due to accident, may additional 500,000 na may pupunta sa family, no, if you avail of this additional uh, additional rider. Sorry. No? And then, finally, another additional rider that you can avail of with this amount of investment is the waiver of premiums in case of total disability. And the living benefit rider is always free. It comes free with a plan. So it allows you to advance 60% of uh, the face amount, which is 500,000. So your life coverage, kasi natin, I double of the face amount. Now on the earnings component, dito na lumalabas yung guaranteed endowment. So for this plan, you are guaranteed to get 40,000 every other year, starting year six. No? So if you can think about it, para siyang pension plan. No? So it's a pension plan that starts even before you retire. Kasi from the moment you reach your year six, so 36 years old, si, si non-smoker male na ito, may makukuha na siya 40,000 every year, other year for life until age 100. So that is an ideal savings component for the person for future milestones or for retirement. No? And again, if he leaves this in the plan, it will earn interest. No? On top of that, this plan also provides dividends. So itong dividends, that's why it's a range of values kasi ito yung hindi guaranteed, although may binibigay talaga based on the performance of some men. So for this particular plan, this particular amount of investment, you're looking at 10,000 to 6,000 dividends. And these are earned year one onward. So just imagine, kahit na we're in the 10-year contribution period pa rin, we're already earning money. No? So parang bumabalik sa atin yung hinulog natin. Now at age 65, let's say 
the the person who got this plan wanted a retirement plan out of this. No, may dalawa siyang options. Option one is to surrender, meaning finish the plan. So, ang makukuha niya is cash value. So, ang makukuha niya is 2.5 million. So, if you compute, that's around the 3% interest rate. Now, ang kagandahan din dito is just in case, what if before nung age 65 ay nawala siya, nakalood, or naging totally disabled, yung potential of being protected further is there din, no? So imagine yung 1 million coverage na ibigay sana sa family if something happened. Or if naging totally disabled, hindi na naghulog si uh, non-smoker male. Ang nangyari na lang is si son ay pinaghulog. And makakakuha pa rin yung person na yun ng 2.5. Now the second option, which most people avail of, is to just keep the 1 million insurance. Kung baga, to keep the plan intact and to just get the earnings part. No? So by doing that, you can get 1.79 million of funds. So that's roughly translated to almost 2% interest. Again, still higher than the bank. Now, on top of that, yung kagandahan dyan is tuloy pa rin yung plan. May 1M insurance ka pa rin for estate planning purposes or for your family, no, per se, no? And then you get to continue earning endowments and dividends still until age 100. So, yun yung maganda dito is you have two options all the time you know, to surrender or to keep the plan and just get the bonus earnings. So, yeah. No? So, based on all of this, ito yung ideal purposes. Number one, trust fund. So, sino sa inyo dito ang merong mga kids? Can we see in the chat box? So, if may mga kids kayo, no? a lot of people decide to get this plan for their kids, so kahit as young as 30 days old, pwede na. So just imagine, from 0 years old until, until age 100, may makukuha siyang endowment, 6th year and every other year thereafter. So maganda siya parang nest egg already for your uh, kids' future milestones. Yun. Now, as a trust fund, you as the parent would be the owner, so you have full control of the plan, the fund, and you have full control also as to when you want to transfer this ownership to your child. Maybe when he graduates or starts his first job or gets married and so on. It's also a very flexible fund for you per se, for each life stage. No? So whether you're in your starting years, no, you're saving for milestones, you just started work, or you're still single, no, you're still thinking about your uh, own mga milestones that you want to reach, or whether you're a newlywed or married couple, no, wala pang kids, you're thinking about your family, making sure that you have something to leave behind if anything happens, knock on wood, no? Making sure then that in the future, meron kayong uh, savings or components so you can retire together comfortably, no? grow old together happily. No? So yan yung family protection part. And then when you have kids, you can use this plan as a portion of your education fund or your kids' education fund. Pwede natin gamitin yung every other year na endowment. Tira lang natin doon. Let it accumulate interest. So that, pag 18 na yung anak, we can withdraw that and give it to pay off the tuition fee. And of course, when we reach our golden years, it can be used as your retirement plan. No? It can be used as a legacy plan if we uh, decide to keep the coverage pa rin, no? And it can be your estate plan. So, pag uh, imamanan ng kids natin yung properties, etc., at least this coverage will help pay off any taxes that the government will charge for estate tax. So, in a nutshell, these are the things an endowment plan has. Number one, guaranteed contribution. So, meaning to say, kung ano man yung schedule ng hulugan, yun na yun, no? fixed na yun, and for sure, after that, for life na yung coverage natin. So, of course, that means the premium load is Slightly higher than the VUL, simply because we have a guaranteed contribution component. You get the cash advance for terminal illness through the unique living benefit rider that is uh, only applicable for traditional or endowment plans. You get guaranteed earnings not affected by the market. So the endowment keeps on giving even if the market is doing uh, poorly. No? And then the earnings are separate from the, the protection, meaning you can withdraw the earnings, the bonus earnings, uh, without worrying about whether there's enough to sustain the plan. Kasi the moment we finish the 10 years or the 5 years, talagang sure ball na yung coverage na. 
And finally, you get the privilege of growing your funds at an interest rate. No? So by giving this to you, you are able to grow your money or grow your savings at a rate that is usually higher than standard bank. 